You're listening to the American Democracy Minute, keeping your government by and for the people. One of the conspiracy theories trumpeted after the 2020 election was that voting by mail leads to widespread voter fraud. None of it was true. But the GOP attack on mail-in voting risks suppressing some Republican voters, too. In a national Pew Research survey, just 28% of GOP voters now say that any voter should be allowed to vote by mail. Four years ago, 49% of Republicans supported it. In battleground states like Florida, the fifth oldest state in the country, the GOP smearing of mail-in voting could suppress some voters unable to get to the polls. In the 2022 midterms, mail ballots were cast in Florida by over a million Republicans, 1.2 million Democrats, and over 500,000 independents. A November 2023 Tyson Group survey found that 76% of Florida voters had confidence in voting by mail, and a majority supported an automatic mail ballot delivery list and secure drop boxes. This, despite Florida's 2023 law canceling mail-in ballot requests for hundreds of thousands of voters last year, forcing them to reapply. Another bill filed in January would return Florida to an absentee system with limited excuses. The RNC, afraid it will lose votes, really launched its 2024 Bank Your Vote campaign last week, encouraging Republicans to vote early by mail or in person. We'll have more on this tomorrow. I'm Brian Beal.